Hi Cancer, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for March 24th until 30th. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Hmm, Cancer. Looks like there's a fire sign that you'll be running away from. And an air sign that will soon be fading away or that will be, you know, that will, that you will be cutting off. Well, this week is going to be a little bit disappointing. And, well, financially it will still be good and better. But with the people that you're dealing with right now around you, they're the one who will be big, giving you big disappointments and big, uh, you know, um, big stuff. Oof. Ending the week with a heartbroken uh, with a heartbreak, sorry. Okay. Um, there is a family member or especially if you're with a fire sign right now, okay? There is somebody that you'll be running away from and there's also an, an air sign that you'll be cutting off or that is, you know, that you will hear um that they are currently suffering in a like an in health ailment. Um, with the air sign, it seems like there is some severity in their situation, and somebody is just trying to. There are actually two things. Somebody tried to get back at them, and they are currently in the. Um, you know, in a very dire kind of situation right now, especially if they've been going through some legal battles or they, they've been going through some legal disp disputes. And there are some people who just tried to, you know, go after them. And now, you know, they are, they, are, they will be suffering tremendously with, when it comes to their health. And um, with this fire sign, okay, that is trying to govern your life and trying to dominate you. It's like, you, you know, you will be pulling out your strength. You will be pulling out from this person. And you just can't really stand it anymore. You feel like it's time, you know, that you can't really stand it anymore. You can't really stay in this kind of situation like being a slave. Now, this too will both be disappointing you. <clears throat> and it seems like you will be looking for some more changes because you can't really bear the, uh, you know, the drama that's been going on. Um, bear in mind that this air sign, anytime soon, um, there will be some serious and grave situation that they're going to be put in, okay? And if you're thinking about cutting off this person, then, you know, you might cut this person off permanently, Anyway, um, there is a lump sum of money that you will also be receiving. Like, um, there will also be a lawyer who will be reading for you, looking for you. And uh, will also be, like, um, giving you a, a set of documents. And because of this, you feel like, okay, finally, this is the one that I've been waiting for. And it's my cue to go. It's my cue to really leave behind everything that I am in right now and that you only feel so stuck. Now there is a there is a water sign that will be reaching out to you, or that will be um, sending you some communications or some messages, and you'll be very happy, you know, with the uh, with the content of it. But I feel like there are, you know, because of this news or because of this money that you'll be receiving, you will just decide to leave everything behind and for you to track your own journey okay 
the broken heart that you will be feeling is because somebody who is an air sign that you know that might just go and it's a male air sign and um, I feel like you've been waiting for your destiny to shape up and to be fulfilled but unfortunately there will be some things or there will be some obstacles that will be you know standing and if the if if things won't be helped right away it might just get even worse so a person from the past that you have been waiting for for like a long period of time there is a possibility that this person is going through some severe betrayal or violence and I feel like it's time for you to act upon okay set aside your pride and right before you move into a new place or a new house I feel like there is something that you need to do you know in order for you to straighten up your karma in order for you to proceed to your uh, future life and future endeavor I also feel like there is like an air sign woman around you that you will have to weather this storm and you will have to deal with this person since that they will be giving you a lot of difficulties and cruelty and I feel like I just want to put an end to all of this sufferings, all of these ordeals, all of this, you know, dramas that you're currently stuck with. And you don't like it. I feel like you're already starting to think of finding a new job someplace else. Or, you know, um, calling up your, your contacts, your friends, your work colleagues from different places because you can't really stay in this place any longer and you're already growing so impatient now and you will be successful in doing that because there is like an amount of money that you'll be getting but it's only enough for you to make a brand new beginning. Aside from that, you're not really, you're not really going to tell this to anyone, especially with this fire sign who's been like dipping their finger into your each and every business, account, money, you know, and contracts or work and stuff like that. And you just want, this is the person that you should be cutting off. But the air sign that you feel like you're only trying to take a revenge, you know, I feel like you also need to learn how to forgive. Because do not proceed to your journey with a heavy baggage. Because it will just pull you down. Okay. Finances. Money will be coming. Okay. I feel like there is also a lump sum of money that you will be getting. And you'll be very happy. I'm getting either it's 2000 22000 220000 Or possibly $2 million. Okay. But in overall, you don't really have to worry about the new beginning that you're thinking about because you will be blessed and you will be guided. But do not proceed with your journey with heavy heart and much grudges because you're not going to reach up to your destiny. It will tire you. It will drain you. It will consume the rest of you. All right. So anyway, that's it for you for this week, Cancer. If you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.